Hey, how you doing? Ah, pretty good, under the circumstances. About to knock off a federal government building. Oh, meanwhile, my psychotic former BFF is trying to figure out a way to kill me. But hey, the meds are kicking in. So life's good. Well, exactly. Franklin got us what we need. Put those on. Then what? Then head in there and uh, rig up a slightly more sophisticated fire trap than we've got here. So, I'm guessing drapes and scent of candle aren't going to do the trick, huh? No, 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 no. We will have incendiaries and a remote device. Now, they need to be strategically placed so we can ensure that we still have access to the server and that the structure maintains its integrity. Now, once you get out, trigger the bombs, meet up with Franklin and the crew, and we'll intercept the emergency call, and you all go in as firemen. Oh, got it? Yeah, I got it. it. Sounds a little idiotic. Well, under the circumstances, it was the best I could do. And if you remember, you were the one who chose to do it like this. Oh, come on. But, you know, Trevor has a point about you. You whine too much. Yeah, fuck you. Oh, don't even try it. Don't worry. It's almost that time, Frank. Link up with Moda and Welsh. Get the fire truck. Be ready to go as soon as I say so. Shit, we'll be good to go. Me and Gus will, at least. You? I don't know, dog. Are you really humming on that sausage? No, I'm cleansing myself. Like, like, like wheatgrass on your radio. That's how you cleanse yourself. But wheatgrass tastes awful. It tastes awful. Of course it does. But a sausage-shaped horn does not. You understand? The wheat grass to you. You new? Just go through the turnstile. Yeah, they keep changing the contractors. Yeah, because guys like me keep losing their jobs and agreeing to do this for less. All right, head up. Thirty.
There you go. For all the money spent on domestic intelligence, we haven't even developed usable indexing software. Ugh, I'm counting the days until there's an algorithm that can do my job for me. You know you stay too late when the mopping dead show up. They don't work so hard. Building's closing any second. Hey, charge is set. I'm out of the building. Hey, dog, we right around the corner. We got your gear in here with us. Hey, look, everybody cool, right? Because once we pick him up, it's all go, all right? 
In and out, Holmes. Let's do it. Trigger the fire bombs, Frank. I'll get my turnout gear on. Ah, oh, man! Kai, 
behind her. That explosion must have knocked me out, man. All right, listen. We're down a floor from you, but look out. There's a team of agents coming your way. They know where they're
We need to get to the ride and torch this fire truck as soon as possible. I'm working on it. Yeah, because if they connect the dots, man, I don't know. Man, I'm working on it. Any minute, they'll be looking for us. I mean, those guys in the building you took down. If they knew, who else is gonna know? It ain't worth thinking about, dog. Trust me. I'm gonna get us there as fast as I can. All right, shit. Shit. I just don't wanna run into something. Man, y'all don't wanna run into Trevor, bro. That's who you don't wanna run into. Haha, <laughs> you're right. So, uh, take us to our get out, avoiding the cops, the feds, and my dear friend Trevor Phillips. All right, man, I'll try. Try real hard, okay? Can you get there any quicker? We should have stashed it closer. I'm getting nervous, Frank. Chill out, bro. Oh, shit. Take us to Lester's. Fly the West The wall? Really classy. Now that we're clear, I can probably tell you people. I didn't think we were gonna make it out of there. Uh, one of us didn't. We lost a dude, man. Oh, yeah, shit. I don't like speaking ill of the department, know what I'm saying? But that dude was in over his head. Yeah, he wasn't top draw, but I thought we could carry him through it. I guess I thought wrong. Well, anyway, we made it out, so we got that to be thankful for. Hugh's people will get his paycheck and the standard expenses. Yeah, man, unfortunately, Hugh wasn't really cut out for this work, man. His mind was on other things. Why you say that? Man, he told me he was writing a screenplay. Did he give you a copy? I'd like to read it. Why? Well, you forget. I'm in the business. This guy gets killed in a raid on the Bureau, and we produce his picture? There's some free press. They call that, uh, pre-awareness. Yeah, all right, man. Sure. How very fine wounds. We never say anything mean or crude. It's the new America, the one we've always wanted. Hey, don't get me wrong. America's a great land. You know, it proves you can conquer anything with booze and syphilis, and I've had both. Hey, those colonizers caught syphilis in this country and took it to Europe. Serves them right for wiping out the indigenous culture. Oh, here we go. The hippie lesson of the day. Culture smulcher. And now Los Santos is just coffee shops, banks, and pharmacies. So, culture. So we had to wipe out a few people. I need a bean machine coffee. I'm stressed. I love this town. You know, you can be smug about the rest of the country and live in a vacuum pretending that there's an endless supply of revenue to just hand out to people and for new metro projects. You know where we're obsessed with Hey, no more of that! People are dumping chemicals on their lawns so much that it gives their neighbors birth defects. I mean, this is a state that's got the worst carbon footprint in the world while everybody goes around pretending they like the outdoors. This is a proper liberal's paradise, man. And I worked hard to be king of this paradise, Michelle. I work hard, okay? Your younger generation, millennials, don't understand that. You just listen to your iFruit phone and do yoga. When I kill over dead from working, I want you to say, that Laszlo, he died of a broken heart. Well, cocaine broke your heart. Well, a bit of recreational snort never hurt anyone. Besides, the chicks love it. Anyway, all I do is Molly now. 
It's, it's virtually a hell food. Let's go to the phones. Marshall, from where to Del Sol? Hey, Lazlo, I take real issue with what you said about marching bands. They're brilliant. They're really erotic. <laughs> marching bands? With your matching Napoleonic costumes? Turning rock classics and pop hits into garbage? Oh, look, I'm a toy soldier blowing into a tuba. Do you think a stadium full of drunks cares about your stupid song? We want to see bitches shooting t-shirts. Oh, look at me. I'm an adult in a marching band. Oh, boy. You need help, dude. At least I'm not pretending to be someone half my age. Good point, Marshall. He got you there, Laz. Speaking of lost souls who need a bunch of help, I think we have the perfect guest for you. Laszlo, introduce him. Coming up on Chattosphere with Laszlo and Michelle. And... Michelle and Laszlo. That is what I said. It's not. Well, whatever. Let me speak. Saddled with a woman to appeal to more liberal listeners. I am liberal. Hey, this is Lester Crib, ain't it? A TV show, which makes me liberal. So shush, woman. Coming up next, what do we? Uh, oh, not this again. Keep your heads down, you hear? Take this producer. <laughs> well, what? I never thought I'd see you clowns again. We did it! <laughs> Fucking A right, we did it. Ow! How was it? For a suicidally dangerous mission impersonating emergency services while working a high security government facility, it was surprisingly uplifting. <laughs> Come here. Give me oh. some of that. Hey. Ow, ah. ow, ow, ow. Oh. Sorry, I forgot. You forgot <laughs> my very, very obvious illness? It happens. Uh, whatever. Hey, let's get drunk. Franklin, fill up the glasses. Got some real vintage moonshine, hillbilly type shit. We're gonna be seeing triple and committing incest in minutes. <laughs> just the shit to make a man forget his trouble. Oh, exactly. I am just gonna get drunk as a skunk, and then I'm gonna reverse engineer a webcam and spy on those sorority girls again. <laughs> I'm oh. ill, okay? Give me a break! Cheers! <laughs> <coughs> man, that's some foul ass shit! Oh. <laughs> All right, boys, I hate to break up the ritual, but I gotta go square things up with Davy and Dick uh, For serious? Hey, I just want them to know that now that we did this thing for them, and we have the evidence that we did this thing for them, that we can all go our own separate ways, you know? Well, fuck it. You want me to go with you, dog? No, stay. Have fun. I gotta do this alone. Right now. The sooner the better. It's one way to look at it, eh? Right. <laughs> Besides, I want to put this shit to bed. Then I can figure out Trevor, you know? Get my life back. Go back to being bored and miserable and loving every motherfucking minute of it. Here, enjoy the incest juice. <laughs> <laughs> Man, you boys sure know how to put the fun back in midlife crisis. <laughs>